Senator Cruz. Thank you, Mr. Chairman. Mr. Beckerman, thank you for being here today. I understand this is the first time that TikTok is testifying before Congress, and I appreciate you making the company available to finally answer some questions. In your testimony, you talked about all the things you say TikTok is doing to protect kids online, and that's great. But I want to discuss the broader issue here, which is the control the Chinese Communist Party has over TikTok. Its parent company, ByteDance, and its sister companies like Beijing ByteDance Technology. Now, TikTok has stated repeatedly that it doesn't share the data it collects from Americans with the Chinese Communist Party, and that it wouldn't do so if asked. It has also stated that, with regards to data collected on and from Americans, that data is stored in Virginia with a backup in Singapore. But these denials may, in fact, be misleading. A quick look at TikTok's privacy policy, in fact, just last night, shows there's a lot more than meets the eyes. For example, in the, quote, how we share your information section, one blurb reads, quote, we may share all of the information we collect with a parent, subsidiary, or other affiliate of our corporate group. Interestingly, in June of this year, the privacy policy was updated to state that TikTok, quote, may collect biometric identifiers and biometric information as defined under U.S. laws, such as face prints and voice prints. Mr. Beckerman, does TikTok consider ByteDance, the parent company of TikTok, which is headquartered in Beijing, to be a part of TikTok's, quote, corporate group, as that term is used in your privacy policy? Um, thank you, Senator. Um, this is an important question. I'd, I'd just like to take an opportunity first to clear up misconceptions um, around um, some of the accusations that have been um, leveled against the company. Um, I would like to point to independent research. I understand that trust but, needs to be earned. Mr. Jack Beckerman, I, I get you may have broader points you want to make. My, my question is simple and straightforward. Does TikTok consider ByteDance, the parrot company headquartered in Beijing, to be part of TikTok's corporate group? That's, that's a yes or no. Senator, access controls for our data is done by our U.S. teams. Um, and as independent researchers, independent experts have pointed out, the data that TikTok has on the app is not of a national security importance and is of low sensitivity. But again, we do hold that to a high standard and we have access controls. Okay, Mr. Beckman, we're going to try a third time because the words that came out of your mouth have no relation to the question you were asked. Your privacy policy says you will share information with your corporate group. I'm asking a very simple question. Is ByteDance, your parent company, headquartered in Beijing, part of your corporate group? Yes or no, as you use the term in your privacy policy? Senator, um, I, I think it's important that I address the broader point in, in, your, in your statement. So are you willing to answer the question, yes or no? It is a yes or no question. Are they part of your corporate group or not? Yes, Senator, it is. Yes, it is. Okay, so under your privacy policy, you're explicitly stating that you may be sharing data with them, including biometric identifiers, including face prints, including voice prints. Is that correct? Uh, no, no, Senator. In the privacy policy, it says that if we are to collect um, biometric information, which we do not um, collect biometric data to identify Americans, um, we would uh, provide consent and opportunity for consent first. But you also say we may share all of the information we collect with a parent subsidiary or other affiliate of our corporate group, which means with ByteDance head headquartered in Beijing, correct? Under U.S. access control, sir. All right, secondly, what about Beijing ByteDance technology, which media reports from earlier this year showed Beijing took a minority stake in through a state-banked internet investment Chinese entity, and on the board of which now sits Wu Shengang, a CCP official who spent most of his career in Chinese propaganda, including with a stint at the Online Opinion Bureau under the Cyberspace Administration of China, China's internet regulator. Would you consider Beijing ByteDance technology to be a part of TikTok's corporate group with whom TikTok could share all of the information it collects. Senator, um, I want to be clear that that entity has no affiliation with TikTok. Um, it's based for um, 
domestic licenses of the business um, in China that has, is not affiliated or connected to TikTok. So are you saying no or, or yes or no as to whether Beijing ByteDance technology is part of your corporate group as the privacy policy defines it. It says we may share all of the information we collect with a parent, subsidiary, or other affiliate, and presumably that's where it would fall, other affiliate of our corporate group. Is Beijing ByteDance technology a, quote, other affiliate of your corporate group? Um, Senator, I'm saying that entity deals with domestic businesses within China. And it's not okay, connected you're, with you're having a hard time. You're answering questions I'm not asking. Again, it's a yes, no. Is Beijing ByteDance technology a, quote, other affiliate of your corporate group as your own privacy policy defines it? Senator, I'm just, I'm just trying to be clear to answer your question. That entity is based for, in China for the Chinese business that is not affiliated or connected with TikTok. Okay. So that's twice you haven't answered. Let's, last time you did it on the third, third time, so let's try it again. Again, it's a yes, no. The answer is the same, Senator. Which is? What I just said, that, that entity is... Okay, okay. The, 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 what you just said did not answer the question. So let me just repeat the question again. Is Beijing ByteDance technology a, quote, other affiliate of our corporate group as your privacy policy defines it? Yes or no? Senator, as, as I stated, that entity does not have any any um, relation to the TikTok entity. So I'll point out it took three questions to get you to answer about your parent. You finally answered yes, that you can share all your information with your parent company based in Beijing. I've asked you three times about this sister company that is obviously another affiliate. You've refused three times. That may be revealing, often as, as Sherlock Holmes observed about, about the dogs that do not bark, it may be revealing that, that, that the Chinese propaganda minister that is serving on your sister company and who's been in the business of online propaganda, you're refusing to answer whether they fall under your privacy policy. That reveals, I think, a great deal, unfortunately. Senator, with, with, with all due respect, um, I'm just trying to be accurate here. There's a lot of accusations that are just not true, and I want to make sure that it's okay, clear. Okay, I'm going to give you one more chance, and my time, time is over. But look, in, in baseball, three strikes, you're out. Tonight, the Astros are going to begin winning the World Series. Let's see if, if a fourth strike, you could actually answer the question. And it's, just, it's a simple yes, no. Is Beijing ByteDance technology a, quote, other affiliate of our corporate group as your privacy policy defines that term? Senator, as, as, as I pointed out before, my answer is the same. Yes or no? I, you didn't answer. Senator, I, I appreciate you're trying with, um, with gotcha questions. I'm just it's trying it's to not be, a gotcha I'm question. Be, I'm, I'm asking about to be your policy. I'm just policy. trying to be truthful and, and I, accurate about the, the connection Are you willing between... to answer this question, yes or no? Senator, I answered the question. You have not answered the question. Is it another affiliate, yes or no? I, Senator, I, I stated um, a number of times that that entity is a domestic entity within China for licenses there. And, it's, and, 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 it's and not, apples and it's are red. You stated something that is not the to, question not I asked. Is TikTok it another affiliate as defined under your privacy policy, yes or no? Senator, I answered. You're here under oath. Are you going to answer the questions? Or, I answer or you, the question. Is or not, were you instructed not, not to answer this question? No, Senator. I'm just, you're, you're, so you're just not refusing to answer it because you don't want to? Senator, it is not affiliated with TikTok. Is, is, that's your question. That is the answer. So, so your answer, I want to be clear because you're under oath. Your answer is that Beijing ByteDance technology is not a, quote, other affiliate of our corporate group as your privacy policy uses that term. This is the legal question with consequence. Senator, I, under, I understand the question. Um, I, as I pointed out, TikTok is not available in China. That is an entity that is for purposes of a license of a business in China that is not affiliated with TikTok. So for the record, you're refusing to answer the question. I believe I answered your question, Senator. Yes or no, tell me which one it is. Just give me one word, yes or no. <laughs> Senator, I answered, I answered the question. You're not willing to say yes or no? It's not, it was not a, not a yes or no question. I want to be precise. Okay, I, I want to be, is I want to, this company another affiliate as defined in your privacy policy? That is binary. There's not a maybe. It's yes or no. Senator, I'm, I'm, the way I answered it, I'm not aware that that is the answer to the question. Okay, so you're refusing to answer the question. That does not give this committee any confidence uh, that, that TikTok is doing anything other than participating in Chinese propaganda and espionage on American Senator, that's, children. that's not accurate. And again, I would, I would point you to- if it, were, if it were not accurate, you would answer the questions and you have dodged the questions 
more than any witness I have seen in my nine years serving in the Senate. That is saying something, because witnesses often try to dodge questions. But, but you answer non sequiturs and refuse to answer very simple questions. That, in my experience, when a witness does that, it is because they are hiding something. Senator Murray.